So mm. let me tell you what is the philosophy it represents. Mm. If you see, Nataraja has four hands. Mm. In two of his hands, he'll have a drum and fire. Mm. So the drum represents sound. in our according to our genesis if you look at our puranas how they describe the creation the first created entity is space and the nature of space is sound mm. so om is that is why is uh, is considered the sound of creation so the drum represents creation and the fire represents destruction and if you see it will be uniform in equal position his hands will these two will be equally positioned so mm. how um, he balances in order for for the universe to function creation and destruction should be uniformly balanced so if you are only destroying universe will be destroyed but if you are only creating and destruction doesn't happen you will be flooded it will not work even so, that uh, will be destruction eventually yeah so creation and destruction is uniformly balanced in him mm -hmm. huh? and the circle fire the circle of fire around him represents the cyclic nature of creation and then if you see on his feet again there is a demon called apasmara apasmara literally means epilepsy you know like the epilepsy but actually it is a representation of chaos so he, in order for creation to happen he suppresses chaos under his feet so the chaos is suppressed and that's how he brings about order in the world then one hand you will see abhaya mudra see like this he have one hand abhaya mudra the other hand is called gajahasta mudra which is elephant trunk mm -hmm. so for in order for just just whatever i described about ganesha his range of skills he skilled in so many different things that's his range of skills gajahasta mudra then one leg is lifted which shows what is required for you to escape this continuous cycle of creation and destruction for that you need to learn detachment because we are all the time attached to the world we keep coming back to the world again and again so detachment it represents mm -hmm. and by representing the whole da whole creation as dance mm -hmm. what they indicate is the only real thing in this universe is shiva is mm -hmm. god everything else from the stars to the planets to the tiny little atoms are just different expressions of his dance they have no substantiality only thing real only thing substantial about creation is shiva everything else is just an illusion that's what is represented in uh, the dance of nataraja